Hello friends, this is Ram Kumar as the continuity of our today's trip after visiting Chitar Dam 1 and Chitar Dam 2. Now we are going towards Lower Kodayar Dam, which is situated above Pechapare Dam. So this Lower Kodayar Dam is constructed across the river of Kodayar. Kode so this was the year of completion of this dam is 1972 and the length of dam is 152 meter at maximum height above foundation is 61 meter. Now from Chitar 1 and 2 if you go towards the Pechpare dam you can once if you reach a junction in front of Pechpare dam you have to take left instead of right. If you take right you can reach the Pechi Paradam. If you take left you will seeing a check post. There you have to pay money for uh, each person 20 rupees and if you have bike 15 rupees camera 50, 100 like that either still or video camera. Then you have to proceed further. You have to travel around 15 km inside the Kilamalai Reserve Forest area to reach the Lower Kodayar Dam. You have permission only up to Lower Kodayar Dam. And then on the way you can see few small small waterfalls like Mani Mardamale waterfalls as we have seen before. And then there are two more waterfalls, Twin Falls and Kutiyar Double Falls. Like that you can see. And small small villages are there on that way. So here that upper Kodayar dam is located very near to uh, Nalamukku in Manjamalai hills. From here we can see the lower Kodayar dam wall from a long distance. Such a nice view. Now we are going towards Twin, Twins Falls first. Then let us go to lower Kodayar dam. Now we have reached that Twins Falls. From here, you have to keep your bikes and then you have to walk some 100 meters inside. This Kodayar Dam, which is located in the hills, is noted for its wild view. The two powerhouses in Kodayar Hydro, Kodayar. Powerhouse 1 and Kodayar Powerhouse 2 generate over 100 megawatts. This water that is collected is pumped up from the lower Kodayar catchments as there are no direct stream that serves this dam. So now we have reached the Twins Falls. If you want to take bath, we can take. This is such a nice environment around this waterfalls. It's so silent and you can hear a lot of bird sounds. And from this lower Kodayar Dam, you can, there is a winch to reach the upper parts of the Kodayar Dam for which prior permission is required. This Kodayar are surrounded by dense forest with valuable trees and wild constituent elephants monkeys, snakes, wild boars, deer and many birds. Now we are going towards the lower Kodayar Dam. These roads are bit narrow so I have to ride very carefully because it's like up and down roads. On the way, we can also see that Aindu Malai, which is near to uh, Agasekoda Malai hill stations. See, while you're going, you can see few places, some natural waterfalls near along the road.
so you can take a photograph of with that natural waterfalls and finally now we reached that lower kodayar dam this is such a steep dam which is constructed across the kodayar river this is a power plant from here also they are producing power both from lower and upper kodayar dam totally around 100 megawatts and this surrounding forest areas over 42 species of tropical trees are found there is a view point near this dam from which fetch for dam perinjani and chitta reservoirs can be seen the agastyar mountain can also be seen from this view point but uh, you need prayer permissions to reach that upper kodayar dam then only you can see those things since it's a reserve forest we cannot go inside without any proper permission this is very small dam but this is they are using this dam for only to produce electricity by pumping water from that upper kodayar dam to here so this is all about lower kodayar dam let us see the remaining things later thank you for watching this video